The LAPD is alerting residents to, to be extra mindful and on guard after a, a recent spate of violent robberies across the city of Los Angeles. Mario's in the Fairfax uh, district with more on this uh, public safety bulletin. What propelled them to do this? They, obviously, they've seen a, a rash of these kind of uh, robberies. That's right. They saw a trend, Michaela, the LAPD, and now they're putting out information to help deter this type of activity. We've been talking about the rise in crime here along Melrose Avenue for months on Good Day LA. Now the LAPD is warning residents about an ongoing trend of follow home robberies. Take a look. The department releasing this community alert. Police say that victims are being followed from places like the Jewelry District in downtown LA, nightclubs, high end restaurants, and here along Melrose Avenue where there's been a recent string of violent armed robberies and surveillance video capturing some of these incidents over the last several months. In one, you'll see sidewalk diners are robbed at gunpoint here along Melrose. Police say the target of these robberies has been expensive jewelry, including watches and necklaces and expensive purses. Victims also being targeted based on the type of vehicle they're driving. The LAPD says it's happening more frequently throughout the city with victims being targeted, watched, and then followed home. And they recommend being cautious of displaying high-value property in public, being aware of your surroundings, when walking out of a restaurant, mall, or nightclub, recording and reporting suspicious activity or vehicles to police. And if you feel like you're being followed, call 911 or drive to the nearest police station if possible. And back out here live, this is a good example of it, Michaela. Many of the shops and restaurants here have increased surveillance. Some have even hired security during the day to scare off some of these potential criminals. Meanwhile, the LAPD says it's increased patrols here along Melrose Avenue with officers both on foot and on horse back here, Michaela. Concerning, uh, concerning that they've seen uh, a rise in these kind of things. Again, uh, likely they're giving some more uh, ideas about what we can do to protect ourselves. You want to make sure that you know where you are, try to leave some of those valuables at home, uh, and just take the precaution you know you need to take. And Michaela, they're also releasing some tips for those who are victims of a crime like this. They say you should never uh, try to fight with a robbery suspect. Always cooperate. And right after, immediately after, you should try to jot down, write down any information you may remember, a suspect description or a vehicle license plate number, anything that could lead to an arrest as well. Not, not easy when, when you're in that kind of uh, distress, obviously, but hopefully that will happen. All right, Mario, thank you so much. Appreciate it.